Yeah, so I was in the heat of the moment. My condom broke and I probably should have stopped. I didn't. I was in the heat of the moment. <laughs> so I was married for 17 years and um, I'm now getting back into the dating scene. So I'm single and dating and um, you know, I'm having sex and I'm careful, but, but sometimes I'm honestly not that careful. Me and my boyfriend have a committed open relationship and we've agreed to play safe outside the relationship but we don't use condoms inside the relationship. I was a little bit loose back in the day. And he was wild back in the day. I actually met this girl at a party. She was a, a friend of a friend of a friend, so. You're supposed to use condoms for oral sex, but let's be honest, who must use condoms for oral sex? There are all these different diseases out there that I don't remember being worried about when I was younger. He'd asked me if I ever been tested, and I told him yes, which was actually a total lie. I practice safe sex, but uh, to be honest, I didn't practice safe sex all the time. And honestly, is it I? Right. 19 million people have a sexually transmitted disease. When you're sleeping with someone, you're sleeping with everyone else that they've slept with. Hello. You can get syphilis from unprotected oral sex. With chlamydia, for instance? You can have it and you might not even know. Sometimes there's symptoms and sometimes there's not. I have a, a daughter. I don't want to be in a situation where um, she has to worry about me being alive because I caught something out there from somebody. What I do is I get tested every six months in order to protect myself and him. I might want kids someday. I go and I get tested twice a year. I decided that I would get tested because I really care about it. I thought I probably should get tested. All right, let's just go in and, and make sure that we're okay, you know, that we, we kind of have a clean slate to start with on our relationship.